Hey everyone, welcome to this video where I'll be working through my Kanban board project built using Monistat, MongoDB, Express, React and Node.js. This is simple yet powerful task management app which allows user to create sections, add a task, move the task across different sections and assign tasks to the different users. It also includes authentication meaning user can sign up or login and see their own task. Today I will show how it works and deep dive into the technical detail behind it. So let's have a quick demo of this project. Whenever a user visits this app, at the top they can see sign up login button. They can create their account by entering their name, email and password. Optionally they can upload their profile picture. After successful sign up, they can log into their account by entering their email and password. After successful login, they can see their name and power button. Here we have different sections representing the different stages of task. Each task can be, each section contain task which can be moved across via drag and drop. Here we have add section at the top right. It will create a new section at the right end. Let's have a demo. Let's give the name as future task. It will create a new section at the right end. Okay. And at the top of each sections, we have a more plus icon and more icon. Plus icon will add a new sections after the current section. Means uh, I I clicked this add icon in the to do. It will create a new section after this to do. Let's have a demo. Let's give the title as new section. Okay. It has created a new section after to do section. And the more icon have to fill update title and delete section. Update title will update the title of the section. Let's have a demo. Let's give the name as new sections. Okay. It has updated the title to new section and delete section will delete this section. Okay. Each task display the assignee of the task, due date, title of the task, and the and the description. And each task has more icon. More icon we have to fill delete and update. Delete will delete the task. An update will update that task. Let's do this. Let's update the task. Uh, let's give the name as take mit. T C H take mit. And uh, give the due date as tomorrow. Okay. We can see that a uh, task has been updated. Okay. And delete will delete this task. Okay. For creating the new task, we have plus add task button. We can Create the new task by entering the title of the task. Let's give the task title as new task. Description as design. And uh, due date as yesterday. And assigning this task to some name as Johnny. Okay, it has created a new task. This task can be infinite for each section and a section can be also infinite. At the top we have, uh, we can see that uh, four board and three member is there. Four board represent the, there is four section and three member represent the three user that has been, that have created their account in this. Okay. Uh, that's all we have to do in this project. Okay. I will give a quick overview of the backend for my project built using MongoDB, Express.js and Node.js. I have used Express to create API for managing users, tasks and sections while MongoDB store all the data. Here is our backend structure. Inside SRC we have config which configure MongoDB with Mongoose. Inside feature we have sections, task, user. While middleware handles authentication and token generation. Each of these section task and user have controller model and route controller for handling logic model for defining mongodb schema and route for api endpoint in server.js we have a in slice express define the route for section task and authentication and connect to the mongodb for managing section api get section will fetch the section with task sorted by the creation date 
post section will will create a section with title and save it to the mongodb delete section will delete the section using the section id put will update the section with update the section title using the section id for managing task api get section get get task will get the task for a section okay and uh, post will add the task with name description due date as any in section id and save the task to the mongodb put will update the task using section using task id put will update a task using task id and uh, and return the task uh, delete will delete the task using the task id patch will patch move will move the task with task id by using the task id source id and the destination id and return the updated task with the data okay for managing user user api post sign up will re register a new user with name email password and photo and user photo which is optional and uh, save the user to the mongodb post login will authenticate the user authenticate the user verifies the credentials and return the token count get count get count will get the total number of the user get count will return the total number of user get me will return the current login user will return the current login user using npm run dev the server starts on port 5000 allowing the front end to interact with the back end now i will give the quick overview of the front end code for my project built using react redux react dnd and for a modern and responsive design i used material ui the project is organized into two main folder store for state management and component for the ui uh, api handles the http request for crud operation component uh, contain the reusable elements like uh, section task card task form update task form auth form and store store contains store is a redux logic for managing the state for section task and user actions like add update delete the task and sections and i think handle the api call for crud operation uh, let us first see the auth/js it manages the authentication sign up login logout fetches the current user current user count and it store data and handle the authentication state uh, kanban slash dot js uh, it handle all the kanban related action like uh, add uh, add section update section add a task delete task update task and moving task between the section move task and store.js combine these two slices kanban uh, reducer and auth reducer and configure the redux and configure the configure the redux state for global state management auth form.js uh, this component uh, uh, this element this component manages the sign up sign up login form for user authentication it update the redux state upon successful sign up Uh, board uh, dot js. This is the main board component. It fetches the user, user task, and section from the API. It also handle add uh, sections. Uh, if the state is in loading state, then uh, loading loading screen component will be rendered.
uh, this is for uh, search and auth button at the right top uh, this is for mobile the uh, mobile door means uh, if the screen is of size mobile then this will be rendered this is the main board component uh, this this uh, section this is for section section mapping and here at the right top uh, there is section button and this rendered the section pop up and this is for auth form pop up sign up login uh, this is the simple loading screen i am designed and uh, this is the section.js section.js represent the individual task individual task column it support the adding new task adding new task and handle add section also delete section and update section it also uses the use drop use drop use drop to use drop hook allow us to receive the drag task and trigger the move task Uh, task card dot js display each task each display each task and user can drag a task between the section open a menu for updating and updating and deleting task okay i've used use drag use drag uh, use drag for making the task draggable making the task draggable this render the this render the assigning due date task description and uh, this is the description description and and uh, this is the task dialog task pop up form task pop up form for updating the task uh, task form this is uh, this is the task form display the display the form for creating new task it is a reusable pop up that collect the task detail task detail update task form like similar to task form but allow editing the task allow editing the task with the prefilled data prefilled details of uh, user sorry prefilled uh, detail of name description due date and assigning okay the main app.js render the board kanban board and this is the index.js where the execution is start uh, so guys that's a quick overview of my kanban board project code i hope you found this helpful feel free to explore the code and ask any questions and thanks for watching